Hello there and welcome to another video by the MXQ project. So today's video is all about installing Remix OS 2.0 onto the MXQ Pro S905 Amlogic TV box. So Remix OS is Android, that's what it essentially is. This version of Remix is based on Lollipop, so that's 5.1.1. And Remix OS is sort of a desktop environment mixed with Android. You'll see what I mean when you actually install it. I've done a video on this just a couple of days ago. And if you'd like to check that out before you attempt this and see what you think about it, then go right ahead. I'll even link a link in the description to where you can actually go to the actual website, the Remix website, and have a look around there. You can also try this on your PC and a ton of different pieces of hardware as well, not just this box, okay? It's a very big development and it's a very exciting development and it's very interesting as well. So if you want to crack on and see what it's all about, then I suggest you do before attempting this. So just to dis as a disclaimer, really, I cannot guarantee this is going to work on your hardware. So I know it will work on my MXQ Pro. It's actually on here at the moment and it's running just fine. So this is a generic MXQ Pro S905 hardware. You probably got a very similar piece of hardware as well and the chance that it will work and install etc but again i cannot guarantee that for you there's about four different pieces of firmware we can try i may on the remix os website and there are four different brands i mean the one i'm using is just really a generic mxq pro s905 piece of remix firmware that they have it's official as well there's also a version for the Tronsmart version. So maybe you've got a Tronsmart version of this. It looks exactly the same. And I'm pretty confident inside it's probably identical as well. There's also a few different brands as well that it's available for. They all run the Amalogic S905 socket. So just keep that in mind when you're trying this. I can't guarantee it at all. So if it bricks your box, guys, just be aware. But make sure you know what you're doing, all right? And make sure you know how to recover your box as well if things go horribly wrong. Because it can do, it can happen. So anyway, let's move on to the first part. I'll show you where to get your files from. So we're going to go and grab our Remix OS file. We're also going to go and grab TWRP because that's what we're going to use to install it. And then we're going to pop them onto an SD card and then boot TWRP from your SD card tray on the side of your box. And then we're going to use TWRP to in install Remix OS. It's a very simple process. Let's move on to the first part. So let's head to jide.com. I'll leave the links in the description. And then just go a little bit further down the page and click supported devices. Now again, go down to the bottom of the page and you'll see MXU Pro, you'll see MX, etc. They're all for the S905 processor. Click on the appropriate one. I want to use the MXU Pro and download that firmware. Next thing you need to do is go over to grab TWRP, I'll leave the links again in the description where to get this, and the link for TWRP is just here. Next, we need to rename that recovery image file to just recovery as shown, and it will display as a recovery.image file when you check the properties as shown here. So it just says recovery.image. Once you've got your zip file and your recovery, just place them onto an SD card, and then let's move over to the next part. So to boot TWRP from your SD card, pop your SD card into your MXQ Pro or whichever device you're using. Grab yourself something thin and sharp because on the back of your box you've got an AV port and inside there is a little button. And we need to press that before we apply the power. So pop in your HDMI cable and then Pop your thin and sharp object inside the AV port and you'll be able to hear that button on the camera. Now we need to hold that in and then apply power. Now to go over that again, pop your SD card in the SD card tray, HDMI cable in and then thin and sharp object into AV port, hold that button in and then apply power. And what should happen is TWRP should boot. Now there is a another way to actually get to your RP to boot from your SD card. That's using an app called Rasher. I won't cover that in this tutorial, but I'll leave a link in the description to where you can download that little app. It's an Android APK and it allows you to boot into recovery. And you'll see what I mean when you install the app. 
but for this one we won't cover that one now before you do anything i suggest you back up everything on your current system you just swipe to back up it and it'll just store a file called twrp on your sd card just remember to select storage and select micro sd card and then it'll save everything onto your sd card so let's move on to installing it so click install so if you just i'm going to select remix you might ha have this one and this might work for you it all depends on your hardware it's just a case of trying it all out so i'm going to select remix and then all i'm going to do is swipe to confirm and what's going to happen is all it's going to do is start installing the system it might actually take quite a while to actually do it maybe five to ten minutes and once done it will reboot and then remix will do its initial installation so hopefully twrp booted and remix installed okay now i confused myself a little bit through the process of making this video and i was convinced that this seno 5 um, firmware on the Giant website works with my with my hardware, the MXQ hardware I've got. Um, it, it doesn't. Um, I just found that out during the recording of this, um, so ignore that. But it might work for you. That f particular firmware might work for you. I don't know. So it's just a case of trying it out. It didn't install for me. It just kept up bringing up errors. Um, so I remembered that the guy who builds TWRP for the S95, um, which is the next box uh, device, his ROM was the one that worked for me and I'll leave the links in the description to where you can get that firmware. Again, it's just a zip file, do exactly the same, place it onto the SD card along with a recovery.image and boot it and just follow the guide exactly the same. If that doesn't work, then you can try all the different variations of the Remix um, S905 firmware that's available on the Jive website. So that's it for this video. Hopefully everything's went okay for you. If not, keep trying, keep plugging away. Just make sure you back up your firmware before attempting to install anything because it could just totally brick it, etc. And we shall see you on the next video.